Louisville Public Works is making a push to stop people from illegal dumping. WDRB's Dakota Sherrick learned what measures the city is taking and why the department believes this is an easily avoidable problem. Dakota. I'm standing in just one of the illegal dump sites we discovered today. And from what I've learned, a lot of the electronics and items causing an eyesore here could be disposed of legally for free. TVs, tires, and trash can be found illegally dumped throughout Louisville Metro. It can be really disheartening for those that live around there. And if you are just visiting an area of town and that's all, and you just see trash everywhere, it definitely doesn't make you want to come back. Public Education Supervisor Karen Maynard says it's an issue that creates a number of different hazards. The problem is even impacting recycling sites like the one here in Fairdale, and I'm told that creates its own set of issues are putting items inside those dumpsters that we can't take to the recycling facility, then sometimes that negates the efforts of other residents who were trying to recycle uh, and, and it may not have made it to the recycling center. The Fairdale site is one location with cameras, which Maynard says has helped them identify some of these illegal dumpers. People caught could face a citation, cleanup fee, and possibly have their car impounded, totaling roughly $1,000. Public Works has been posting some of the security footage and impound pictures to social media, trying to discourage those who would illegally dump and to encourage others to report when they see it. In some of our hot spots where we see a lot of dumping, we're really hoping that slows down because, uh, like I said, it does take a lot of time and resources in order to keep, keep that cleaned up. One of the most frustrating things for Public Works, most of these items can be disposed of for free. Being able to legally drop off items, it's not difficult. A waste reduction center off Meriwether Avenue will accept furniture, tires, electronics, and more for free. Some items, like construction waste, have a $60 disposal fee. But it is a lot less than the fees that you will end up paying if you are caught dumping them. For those who don't find the Meriwether location convenient, Metro Public Works hosts monthly pop-up disposal events at various locations in the metro area. The next one will be held at Fern Creek High School on August 28th. Live in Louisville, Dakota Sherrick, WDRB News.